Hi Aries, it's Elle here to do your October 2018 general reading. It's a general reading. It will not resonate with each and every Aries who views the video. Sun, Moon, and Rising. Thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Let's go ahead and get started. All right, uh, two cards for the past, two cards for the present, two cards for the future. Aries, it seems like somebody's in like despair, deep despair, boggled down by you know the the, the everyday stresses of life. Also, there's some you know some relationship type issues. It could be with friends and family. It could be in a romantic uh, relationship or lack thereof for a romance. Some of you are dealing with someone. You don't trust this person, they're coming back around, they, they want to offer something. I don't know if it's what exactly what you want. They want to offer something. You're, you're, this time you're going to, you know, um, put yourself first. It, some of you are thinking about your children too, or your children that you will have. Some of you are pregnant or All right, so past, <clears throat> excuse me, past, present, future. All right, let's go past. Strength card, Queen of Pentacles. Um, Leo, Queen of Pentacles. You guys were really um, digging deep to move forward. Like I said, somebody's bogged down in, in despair. Whatever that may be for you, Aries, or for someone you're dealing with. Um, it might be financial. It may be that. You know, you, you feel that your finances are up and down. They dwindle. It's a roller coaster. Um, some of you were spending just as fast as it was coming in. And some of it was necessary spending. Mm, that was in the past. Uh, let's see. The present. The two of cups. The nine of, yeah. Some of you have high anxiety about maybe um, a romantic situation. Um, or just a successful relationship. This could be business uh, relationship. This could be um, what could be a successful uh, relationship between you and a company, maybe changing the change of job. Um, but whatever this is, it brings you high anxiety. Um, there's a lot of sleepless, restless nights about what is to come, what will happen. There's a lot of unknown. There's a lot of spirit working with you. There's so many fears. It's almost as if you're moving in the dark. For some of you, you aren't doing because you're here. You're not doing anything in regards to this relationship. I mean, like as far as putting in the energy and effort. You may have done that before and you got you didn't get the result that you wanted. So um you're ma you're maintaining yourself in regards to this relationship. The the people on the outside don't see you in heavy despair, low energy. May even be having some um, health related issues, needed to get blood work done. I mean, they don't see this. They don't know that this is going on with you. You're putting up a great front, but um, yeah, it's you're feeling like you can't trust this whatever the two of cups is for you future knight of pentacle two of pentacle so it looks like you're gonna have an offer it comes in slow maybe from a capricorn virgo taurus cancer pisces scorpio leo in particular everybody's here aries sagittarius i mean yeah well yeah aries sagittarius leo looks like your ships are coming in we got the, the bottom of the deck the three of wands it's almost as if the growing pains, what you've prayed for, what you've manifested, what you've done to work for, it's moving along. It's coming in slowly. It still causes you that roller coaster feeling of the Nine of Swords and being unsure and uncertain. Do I end this or do I get in control of my thoughts and move forward uh, in regards to this Two of Cups relationship? But someone wants to offer something or there's an offer in regards to a job. Uh, money coming in um legal i mean this could be so many different things it's the knight of pentacles it's an offer this is also somebody looking at you in regards to are you going to be different are you going to act different are you going to do something differently before they they make this offer 
um, they may even be weighing up the option two very real options this might be a love affair this could be a business relationship or a business deal that's not 100% favorable and, and your take it's, it's going to take some time and contemplation uh, this could be you too uh, Aries it looks like you're waiting some of you put behind a relationship and it caused you heavy despair. It's like two or three stories. Some of you put behind a relationship. It caused heavy despair in doing that because you love this person. There was, there was the idea of a successful relationship. But some of you just chose to be alone. Uh, in the near future, it looks like me. I don't feel like this is a person, a new person. There is, or this could be a new person, but there are two very real options. And someone wants to solidify something with you. Okay, uh, Capricorn Virgo towards Sun Moon Rising. Let's get some Butterfly Oracle cards here. What should Aries be concerned about going forward? Whoever this is, you have you went from Strength to Queen of Pentacles or whatever this is. You may have had some real life altering changes, moving, uh, job loss, or moving career health related issues could be romantic um romantic partnerships gone awry or third party situations health care change yeah that's a support gracefully aging right bottom of the deck family changes yeah and we talked about some of you will be um welcoming new uh new persons in your home having a baby uh, finding out that someone is pregnant someone exits the home enters the home buying a home selling a home i mean there's so many family changes that can happen here some of you um divorcing uh separating getting back in touch with family members health care change get a second third opinion here in regards to your health know that there is support for you and around you um, yeah get get tested gracefully aging uh, this is for the inside and the outside you know of course it's you know the aesthetics of what's going on with you on the outside but it's also about you know with Time and age comes wisdom and knowledge and maturity. Are you gracefully aging? Are you still immature in your ways and your in your thinking and your thoughts and your communication skills? So here are the angel answers. If you have questions out here, here are your answers. Let's see. Some of you are gonna have two very real options to choose. And this could be people, this could be job, I mean, abundance, yeah. I really feel like you've been through a lot. Um, support is here. Things are changing. Abundance, whatever it is for you, let go, okay? Just let go. Some of you are trying to really hang on and hold on to maybe um, old things in regards to relationship. Um, romantic or platonic or family. You've got to let it go in the near future. Okay, choose a new direction. All right, and that may be what this, what some of you have done with the Three of Wands is choose a new direction here. All right, so I hope that this message resonated with you, Aries. It looks like you've got some good energy coming in. You may have had a hard time uh, recently, maybe in dealing with other people, health, and uh some relationship maybe even job but it looks like you once you get firm on what you want and you choose you goodness and abundance comes in for you um you can request a personal reading at my website that's below or send me an email you can find me on instagram instago uh, thank you for tuning in know that i'm praying for you aries pray for me as well take care